Here's the reason for this project. I have this stack of stuff that's been on the end of the CNC machine since Christmas and I need to put it somewhere. I don't want to box it up and lose track of it so it's time to start building some storage cards. I salvaged the casters from an old desk that we were throwing away. They're not very good, but they're perfect for this. I just had to kind of scrounge for any kind of fasteners and bolts I could to get them secured. Moving on to the drawers, I switched to half inch material and even did half inch bottoms for additional strength. When you unpackage these side mount drawer slides, basically what you want to do is pull the sides apart when you extend them like this. You'll find that most uh, brands have some type of lever mechanism that actually holds this guy in place and this smaller part of the frame mounts to the drawer itself and then this part mounts to the cabinet. So you just want to separate those so you can install them. That's all there is to that. When installing these types of drawer slides, I will set the side slide here about a, an eighth of an inch off of the bottom.
And you know, if I don't take the time to put trim on it now, I'll never get to it. So everything went into these four drawers with room to spare. So I've got to take some time and do some more as you can see by the other end of the CNC machine. So an obvious question is what in the world do I need with a CNC machine that's 6 feet wide and 13 feet long? I'll have to save that for another video.